Hi, this is Bob Kay from the Dallas IMS Show. Um, we're here to talk about the JMP Ultimate Builder, and it's a fantastic com uh, competition that's been sponsored by JMP for years. Uh, we have our builder Isaiah. He's in a custom retro class with a real special bike. So rather than me trying to tell you the story, I'll let Isaiah tell you about some of the really tricks thing he has on this 1960s Honda. Hey there. This is basically a 1964 Honda CB77. Um, long story short on this bike, I've always kind of liked the flat track look, but Honda didn't really allow, um, or, or I'm sorry, not allow, but they didn't really have a flat track program back in the 60s. They had a, a street racing program. So basically, I took their street racing stuff, or their street racing parts, and built basically a flat track bike out of it. Um, the, I went with 19 inch wheels here, which is pretty common for flat yep. track. Um, you can see here, I had to make the entire swing arm from scratch. Uh, the original swing arm was just too small for these huge wheels. So everything pretty much from the, from the middle of the bike all the way back, I had to remake just to fit these massive wheels and tires. Um, obviously you want a big brake whenever you're doing some racing. So I went with a big Harley 11 and a half inch brake with a four pot Brembo. Um, what else we got here? Well, you know, this is a bike that would have been really popular on the uh, half mile circuit. For sure. Would have done really well back in those days. Um, you and I were talking the other day, but I had some of those old HRC products too. You know, they uh -huh. had, Honda made some titanium stuff. You see the um, air intakes on there. They had a lot of really trick stuff available at that time in the For 60s sure. um, when we were really growing this sport. And what Isaiah's been able to do is take this, like he said, and transform it to a tracker, which is absolutely beautiful. Perfect period tires, uh, running the great 19-inch uh, was the way to go on that. Mm -hmm. No front brake. We're talking, guys, half a mile, they're probably doing 80 miles an hour, 90 miles an hour into the corner and throwing it sideways. This bike will actually do that. So uh, you've done a great job, Isaiah, on the reproduction, some Appreciate of the parts that. you have. Um, I wouldn't even want to guess what some of this stuff is worth. <laughs> what we're really talking here about, ladies and gentlemen, is unobtainium. Yeah. You, it's not a matter of money. You can't even get some of this stuff the original anymore. original CYB so parts, yeah. I, I really appreciate you bringing this down so the, everybody from the Dallas audience getting to see what you got here. And, uh, you know, I came from the 60s. This is when I used to race and stuff. And seeing this just warms my heart and getting to share this technology with everybody. Is awesome. Just fantastic. So what do you think about the JMP show here? Oh, the awesome. Ultimate Builder? Yeah, we come every year. We, We're uh, just happy to be part of it as well. Well, it's, it's good to have you here. We actually have four more shows coming up. Um, next is Cleveland, Ohio. We then have Minnesota and Washington, D.C. And the final championship is in Chicago. So the winners from each show go to Chicago. They're going to compete for $50,000 in cash and prizes. Plus, more important, the prestige of the U.S. National oh, Championship. Sure, yeah. You know, awesome. so uh, thank you again for bringing this wonderful piece for everybody to take advantage of. I appreciate it.